Hi, I'm Jeff. I'm one of the bed bug guys. We're down here in St. Paul, Minnesota, where we did a heat treatment on this house for Brent. He has a rental property and he has some tenants. He experienced a bed bug problem and he called us and we came down here to help eliminate his bed bug problem. And Brent's willing to say a few words about uh, his experience of working with us. And uh, what do you think, Brent? Uh, they're great. Uh, I had the problem uh, a month ago. I had no idea what to do. I went online, everyone said, all the bloggers, you have to do heat treat. Chemicals do not work. No. I, uh, I dropped an email, I got their number, I left them a phone call, and they jumped on it. I think you were within, in my house within seven days? Yeah. Seven days and treated the house. I, that was amazing to me. I was lost. Um, I've never had bug, bed bugs before. My dad had them at another rental property. He used chemicals. And he said, you have to use the chemicals because it's only $200 to treat. Well, one thing he didn't tell me is that it was $200 every week or every three weeks that was coming out. So it was, it was $1,200 before he was done with the, the heat treat. And that was only half the duplex. So if he did the other half, that would have been $2,400. For chemicals. For chemicals, which apparently do not work. And uh, so I'm really glad I found you guys Yeah. did the heat treat. Chemicals don't work in eradicating bed bugs. They just generally suppress the population, let it just fester, and then it grows, comes back in a bigger infestation. And the worst part about chemicals is that uh, the bed bugs actually build up um, a resistance to the chemicals. And what about the uh, the human factor, infants and pets and? Oh. Yeah, chemicals. The chemicals that people are using to kill bed bugs, they're highly toxic. They're poisonous chemicals and these chemicals attack the nervous system and that's how they're killing the bed bugs we do not use chemicals we use heat and for a supplement treatment we use other organic environmentally friendly products and in this situation it was a huge issue two weeks after our treatment got a call from Dave Bergman the head of the St. Paul hazard material waste he's a fire marshal and head of inspections calling us because one of the children had been admitted to the emergency room and he was told it was caused by the chemicals used to treat for bed bugs which was absolutely amazing to Brent and I <laughs> we both were told that we were in big trouble <laughs> yeah, we were. Oh, it went on for about four or five hours we were able to be completely cleared after we were able to give them the information to prove that we didn't use any chemicals at all. They told us it was 100% impossible that anything that we did was the cause of it. And that's really important as a landlord. Um, we are faced with a lot of challenges. And when Jeff told me that he used heat and for that purpose, and I, I kind of chuckled at first that why would that make a big deal? And it, it did. Um, it's a, it's a safeguard. So I really appreciate you guys watching this video. And uh, if you need any help with your bed bugs, contact us, the bed bug guys. And if you want, Brent will actually allow you to call him for reference. Definitely. I appreciate it. And thanks for t staying tuned.